Puerto Rico. <laughs> Welcome, guys. Thank you so very much for being once again with me. Of course, this is daily tarot reading. I mean, what else, you know, for mm, Tuesday, July 3rd, 2018. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so very much for stopping by. We will start as usual with a little bit drop of astrology, you know, and then we will proceed with tarot. Okay, guys, we have a lot, you know, things, you know, to talk about. So I really do hope so that you are feeling fine. I really do hope so that you love yourself and I don't know, whatever. Okay, so let's get started. Okay. Did I mention that this is daily tarot reading for both men and women all over the world for all 12 zodiac signs? Okay, never mind. Okay, guys, so let me see. Uh, for this Tuesday, Moon is in a sign of um, Pisces. Okay, Moon in a sign of Pisces. Well, this is a very dreamy type of a day. You do not want to go to work. You want to sleep over. You want to stay, you know, in a bed like for at least, you know, like... 48 you know hours you don't like you know like you know talking you know with other people this is uh you know you uh, lying uh, you know in a bed you know resting yourself uh this is you going you know down to the memory lane you are you know lazy you don't like you know to talk about like anything so honey you know meditate do something of that kind you know practice yoga uh, go to the memory lane, simply, you know, think what you can do, like, maybe different, uh, you know, uh, next day or maybe even, you know, next week. Simply indulge yourself. This, this type of energy is not for indulging of other people. This is basically indulging you. Okay, ruler, planet uh, ruler of uh, Pisces is, of course, Jupiter. And Jupiter is still in a sign of Scorpio, still so close to, I mean, in conjunction with asteroid Psyche, both asteroid Psyche and planet Jupiter are still in a retrograde motion for until 10th of uh, July. Okay, so let us talk today about Jupiter in the sign of Scorpio and what basically is the message of Jupiter in the sign of Scorpio. Okay, so here it comes. Um, uh, Jupiter uh, in Scorpio basically is saying to you, uh, stop controlling other people rather control you because you can't control uh, how other people will treat you you cannot control how other people will talk with you you only can control what type of answer you will give to uh, to um, uh, to people all, all around you so stop controlling controlling other people instead of that put under the control your own actions your emotions and your mind especially your emotions now this is also very good, you know, energy to discover your boundaries, to discover your possibilities and, you know, what you want to achieve in external world. But first of all, you need to go inside of you. Every single planet while is in a retrograde, you know, motion, every single planet basically is forcing you go inside, go inside of you and discover because Jupiter also is a sign, uh, I mean, a planet of discovery, you know, so many discovery. But basically, Jupiter is also very spiritual type of a planet. And uh, Scorpio is occult sign, you see. So basically, you know, find out, you know, the way how you are built from inside. Because we are not only like a flesh uh, and bones, you know, we are so much more than that. So in according, you know, to this new discovery, maybe for a couple of you, also you can discover a completely new boundary and possibility for you and for your life. For uh, us, for all of us, another message is to build right value system scorpio what is wrong the opposite sign uh, taurus what is right so for so many people maybe this is you teaching you know someone what is right and what is wrong what is good and what is evil you know so you know maybe this is you teaching someone you know and also stop um stop manipulating other people or stop allowing yourself to be manipulated 
by other people as well. Yes, guys, Jupiter in the sign of Scorpio talks about lots of things. So, you know, today I want to talk about that. Obviously, I can't talk about every single, uh, you know, aspect, transit, you know, planet, asteroid, whatever. So, you know, every single day, you know, I choose to talk about like one thing. So if you regularly watch my YouTube channel, you know, by now, you know, I tried, you know, uh, to teach you or simply to show you, to explain you what those, you know, uh, planets in a retrograde motion basically mean for your normal everyday life. Cut off uh, in the next like three days or so, cut off, you know, finally all the memories and uh, old memories which basically are not serving your higher good anyway, you know. So simply leave that. You simply know, say uh, to, uh, to people who are not in your life anymore, thank you, you know, I'm sending you a blessing, you know, but you, you, you are not the part of my life anymore. So, so many useless energy, I can see so many useless people in your life, most likely you need to get rid of either memory or, you know, concretely, you know, this type of people who basically are only sucking energy out from you. This is why I said, you know, stop manipulating other people or stop allowing yourself to be manipulated by other people. Okay, I can talk on and on and on and on, but this is enough. Okay, so now message for Cancer, Scorpio and Pisces. Ta-da! Refusing, you see. Okay, so Cancer, Pisces and Scorpio, this is you saying, oh, you wanna what you're talking about, you know, I'm not, you know, like that, you know, but maybe there's something in, inside of you refusing to see, maybe even refusing to hear, you know. Guys, I do not know who you are. I don't know what is now like happening in your life, but obviously because you've got... Uh, this type of message, you know, maybe there's, you know, something you're refusing to see. Maybe you refuse to see your own value, you know, Jupiter and Sun Scorpio. Maybe you simply cannot recognize anything good inside of you. Saying, you know, everybody is so good, everybody is so successful, uh, everybody but me. So, honey, simply, you know, uh, your head up, stop thinking about yourself in a such a way. Next uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, this is, what, guys, what I have for you, oh, I'm, you know, I do talk so fast, you know, too fast, okay, Libras, Gemini, and Aquarians, <laughs> new vitality, okay, obviously, this is you being very, very uh, pleased, at least in one area of your life, you know, so this is you uh, singing and dancing, maybe playing uh, some instrument, in maybe maybe you are in an entertainment you know business but basically um take a second and look basically this is a rainbow so this rainbow basically is saying you have so much more energy than everybody else so you know uh and you you might start and most likely you will with something completely new in your life if nothing else if you were like a sick ill or you know, whatever new vitality will help you to recuperate okay who is next? Um, <laughs> uh -huh. Eris, Leo, Sag, Sagis, Leos and Erisis. Spread your wings, honey, what you are waiting for. So you can see a woman, young girl, but also could be a man, right? This is like a street, this is like the sun, and this is basically your target. Spread your wings, find a new target, maybe a new goal, a new aim, and simply follow 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 your dream i think this is it spread your wings follow your dreams uh, and uh, don't allow anybody basically to stop to stop you saying to you well you know you are not you're not good enough you know for that who you think you are and you can basically you can reply i am who i am do you have any problem with that repeat that this sentence all 12 zodiac signs because you know repeating this very simple sentence will give you uh, biggest strength of all i am who i am you know so i can do with my life whatever i want and who is the last but not the least taurus uh virgos and capis happies love okay there is nothing you know i can I can I can attach to it because I mean honey this is love you know so I am I am almost jealous no I'm not jealous I'm happy guys you know for you Taurus Virgos and Capricorns this is you falling in love maybe you are already you know happy 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 
happy, happy, happy. Or, or maybe, who knows, maybe you will meet you know, someone and you will fall in love like over heels. Well, good for you. Ta -da -da -da. Okay, enough of that. Now, let me talk about the very first tarot card, the Sun Tarot. What is this about? Someone is playing mind games with you. Oh, shame on him. Figure it out who and why. Saying one thing, doing another thing. Protect yourself from a risk. Unfulfilled promise. Step back and see clear. Ouch! Oh, this was harsh. So, honey, is there anybody in your life playing with you? Saying one thing, thinking another thing and doing completely another thing. If, if 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 you have this type of a person, man or woman in your life, I mean, you know, uh, you can say to this person, you know, F off. What is that F off? Uh, you know what I want to say, but I want to be f polite. So every single time I am going to say, ta -da -da -da, beep, 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 I will say F off. So maybe it's time, you know, for you to say, you know, F off, you know, from, from my life, you know, beat it, you know. You can't treat me in such a way, you know, saying one thing, thinking another thing and, you know, uh, doing uh, the third thing or maybe not doing. Okay, 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 okay. Now, let me talk about the final four tarot cards for this Tuesday. There are lots of information, a uh, lot of information. So what we have in here, Air of Wands, Rain of Activity, busy, busy, busy a little bit. King of Wands, like a leadership opportunity, Ace of Pentacles, Another opportunity, very quality spread, and the world is yours. All is well. Okay, so guys, maybe this is you. Maybe this is connected with love relationship, but maybe maybe it is not um, uh, by its own. Uh, bulb basically uh, doesn't have to be a bad uh, message, you know. Maybe this is you saying, oh, I have an idea, and bang, this is your bulb, you know, start, you know, lightning all over you, saying, you know, follow, follow, you know, this idea of yours. Okay, can you see this almost leathers, you know, can you see, this is you going up on a hierarchy, and this is rain of activity. During this uh, Tuesday, so many people will be active like never, ever before. So for some of you, maybe for lots of you, you know, so many wishes uh, and desires now will come uh, true, simply will become a reality, you know, so be focused, be creative, follow this bulb of your life, and uh, don't, don't listen that much, you know, other people, because, you know, um, some, some, sometimes, you know, uh, people can give you like a, like a wrong advice, you know, uh, maybe, maybe, you know, people are not negative, but simply, you know, this is someone saying to you, no, nah, you can't do that, you are too old, or you are too young, or blah, 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 but as far as I can see, with the king of wands, you have this leadership, um, um, capability inside of you, but if you are afraid, of course, this is you saying, okay, I ain't gonna do that, I ain't gonna follow, like, my idea, but this is exactly what you should do. Now, uh, opportunities of some kind is coming, because in your daily spread, we have a spread, we have Ace of Pentacles, this is extremely good period for any type of new opportunities, prosperous, prosperous activities, for getting a job, and for some of you, rewards of some kind is coming in the shape of getting a race. This is getting a race. Now, the world, all is well. Now, by evening or late afternoon, when you will come home, this is you basically jumping out from, uh, you know, joy because, you know, something at least will be fulfilled um, like a dream uh, until until basically this Tuesday come to an and so extremely powerful energy for starting a new project, for starting a new job, mingling with another people. For some of you, maybe this is like a humanitarian, any type of, you know, project. And for some of you, who knows, maybe, you know, this is a love. So, you know, King of Wands is a typical Leo Sets or an Aries, you know, basically someone, someone who is very demanding before you enter into a relationship with this person who is obviously extremely demanding, ask yourself, are you here on this planet Earth to be in an equal type of relationship or are you here to indulge this extremely demanding person? So, you know, make your own conclusion. Okay, 
I talked enough. I talked enough. Now Puerto Rico. <laughs> Music maestro. Guys, book a private reading with me. Make sure to subscribe to my channel, like and share this video with your friends. Until tomorrow, God bless you all. Take care. Bye.